听的时候。Anjan ka pala. <laughs> Ilang take din yung pag-ikot-ikot ko dito sa upuan. Hi, welcome back. It's Jay. And today, we are going to discuss yung result dun sa DNA test ko. So, I've done that test a month ago. I just got my result yesterday and I didn't open it kasi gusto ko sabay tayo magbubukas ng results ko. Medyo kinakabahan ako dahil hindi ko alam kung ano yung expect ko. Kasi who knows what's in store dun sa DNA ko and we're going to find out today. If you haven't seen my previous video, please do check out my previous video about Circle DNA, which is a DNA testing kit that is going to give you 500 plus reports on your DNA, including your heritage, your health risks, potential, potential, potential risk more in the future, which you can prepare for. And before we start, please do subscribe to this channel, click the notification bell, give this video a thumbs up, and leave a comment. And without further ado, let's get started. I'm not sure if my code is still valid, but it's jpod33 and you get 33% off your DNA testing kit. It's around 18 days since I've sent it out. Kahapon ko yung nakuha yung email and we're going to check out Circle DNA. Opening Circle DNA and here is, nakalagay dito yung timeline kung ano yung mga processes na nangyari. So, okay, so it arrived at the lab at August 11. The DNA got extracted at August 16. The DNA got analyzed on August 26. And the report has been processed September 3. Nalito na ako sa date. Basta ayun, ayun na nga yung timeline na ito na yung timeline. So we're going to view the results. <sighs> okay, wala ko pala. Ayun. <laughs> First, my origin. Gusto ko ma-check yung origin ko. So, unexpected composition may be revealed by my results. I'm East Asian, 64.47%. Southeast Asian, 35.53%. Japanese and Korean, 5.69%. Sarang eh. <laughs> Chinese. Chinese ako. I'm 58.78% Chinese. Wait lang, na, ano, na, culture shock. Culture shock! Nagulat ako na I'm only 13.93% Filipino. Mind blown. Sobrang mind blown ako. Apparently, I'm not full Filipino. Kala ko full Filipino lang. Kala ko siguro yung lalabas is 80% Filipino, 50% Filipino, and some other mixes. Pero nagulat ako. I'm mostly Chinese. <laughs> So we're done with the ancestry composition. Hindi ako makamove on. Hindi ko alam kung natuwa ako or na-disappoint ako dun sa nabasa ko. Hindi ko Pinoy. <laughs> so anyway, let's go with diet. Highly sensitive ako sa alcohol. That makes sense. So dapat low-fat diet ako. Tapos nagkikito ako. So this is a good thing na nalalaman ko siya that I should be low-fat kesa magkito ako which is probably going to be bad for me. I'm highly sensitive to caffeine. Hindi na ako magkakap eh. Minig, minig levels. Like, shh, ganun. Chura ko dyan. Less caffeine na dapat ha. Do you feel insensitivity? This is cha. I'm better with cha and cocoa beans, which is also containing theophylline. Fat sensitive ako. It makes sense kasi nasa dugo ata namin yung high cholesterol and stuff like that. Stay away from fast foods, trans fats, mga donuts, pizza fries. Sige, iingatin ko na yung diet natin, ma'am sir. Salt sensitive. I'm not sensitive to carbs. So okay lang na mag-rice ako. Rice is life. Kaya okay lang tayo dun. Let's continue. A lactose intolerant. Likely intolerant ako. Hilig-hilig ko pong mag-gatas. Kaya siguro ako natatay pag, pag nagkakape ako with milk. Spice sensitivity normal. Yes, I love spicy food. Taste sensitivity super taster. What is that? Pwede na mag-food critic. Sobrang ano ko ba? Super taster daw ako. So, sobrang nalalasahan ko yung, yung mga food influences or individual eating behavior. Since nalalasahan ko siguro yung every flavor, natutuwa yung dila ko eh. Gusto kumain. Weight regain. Average risk. Okay, that's good. Detox needs should be. Okay, I need to detox more often. Toxin generation speed, normal. Normal pressure. Ang dami pala nito. 
So let's continue with uh, sports and fitness. So dapat medium power, medium endurance, and medium strength. Consider basketball, football, table tennis. I've done foot table tennis in grade school. I've done football, pero like konting lang, rang intrams lang ng high school. Optimal training type is medium lang din. So blood flow is higher. More oxygen effectively reaching my body's tissue. Okay, that's good. More nutrients can be carried to your muscles. Okay. Agreed. Hindi naman ibig sabihin pala siya na bad thing. But it's also could be a good thing. It's just higher. Fatigue resistance. Yes, hindi ako mabilis matagod. Endurance capacity, medium. Lactate clearance, below average. It's not good. Strength profiles, medium. Water loss. Power capacity, medium. Yes, I don't really lift heavy weights, especially because I don't spotter. Usually, ano lang ako, yung kaya ko lang. Let's continue with the sleep. I'm a night owl. Explains a lot. Di talaga ako mahilig matulog ng maaga. Ever since I was a kid, night owl talaga ako. Insomnia talaga. Natutulog ako 3, 4, 5 a.m. Stress tolerance, warrior. Stress ka lang. <laughs> so, I guess kaya ko yung stress. I can handle it. Pero syempre, hindi ko naman kaya lahat. Sure. Sa skin! <laughs> skin ages yung girl, pero lagi ako napagkakamalang matanda. Lagi nila sinasabi na nasa 30, 40 plus na ako. Ba't ganun? Acne risk, high. Sa face siguro hindi, pero nung younger years ko is lagi ako nagkakaroon ng acne sa likod. As in, buong likod ko, puro acne yan. At least ngayon, medyo nag-clear na siya. Medyo meron pa akong mga marks and stuff, pero it's okay. Wrinkle formation, average lang. Stretch marks, average. Mas stretch marks kaya ako. Madama ko stretch marks. Keloid scores, hindi ako keloidal. Skin lightening ability. Ability! Ano superpowers? Normal. Skin photo aging risk, ang ilaw natin. Nakaka-wrinkles na. Sunburn risk, high. Moreno ka na nga. Mabilis ka pang na-sunburn. Ano na? Hyperpigmentation, low. I guess, okay naman yung skin ko. Pollution, stress, and sleep. Well-being, let's check. Normal. Normal naman. Life longevity. Average long. We average 40, 50 years old. Okay. Nutrition. I need more iodine. I need more magnesium. Omega-3. At least ngayon. I know, I do need it. Oh, vitamin B6, vitamin D. Let's go on natin ng paaraw. Next is success traits. Intelligence. Normal lang. Hindi <laughs> mo lang ako excellent or gifted. Normal na tao lang. Tumagal ba naman ako sa college? <laughs> so, emotional quotient is excellent. Above average. So, ibig sabihin, I'm more of a heart. Puso, bago, utak. Good thing ba yun? Mas affectionate siguro. Entrepreneurship. Tendency. Excellent. Running a business someday. Uh, creativity is normal. I used to think na sobrang creative ko. Education attainment, normal. Information processing power, is normal. Language ability, okay. Mathematical skills, normal. Memory skills, normal. So, bali yun yung pinakamababa. Kasi hindi naman nila ilalagay dito na Low. <laughs> Puro normal lang. Ganun. At least excellent ako sa entrepreneur and emotional. <laughs> so, music and dance. <laughs> gifted? Gifted daw ako. Bakit ganun? Hindi siya nagtatanslate. Magiging singer na ako. This will be a music channel. <laughs> so, dance ko is... Gifted. <laughs> Sasayaw na ako sa TikTok. Although sumali ako sa dances sa school, pero nakakahiya yun nung, nung sumayaw ako sa school. Nakakahiya. Kaya di ako sumasayaw. So let's continue to our personality traits. So likely balanced naman ako. Hindi naman ako neurotic. Sobrang basic lang yung ano ko, personality trait ko. Behavioral traits. Less likely to be alcohol addicted. Less likely to be food addicted. Less likely to be obsessive with washing and cleaning, and less likely to be smoke addicted. I don't smoke, drink only on occasions. I guess normal type. Physical traits: facial body hair, likely normal. Body odor. Probably na wala siya na judge ako. Likely more than normal. Earwax type, likely wet. 
Likely white. Eye color, likely brown. Yes. Pain sensitivity, likely high. Oh, I don't think so. Smell sensitivity, likely stronger. Yes. Sweat, likely more than normal. Persistent. Thinness. Slim daw ako. And then, less likely thin pa. <laughs> <laughs> Less likely thin, so I'm not thin at all. Uh, waist circumference is average. Gender traits. I am a thrill seeker. Male sex hormone levels normal. Family planning. This section lets you know if you are a carrier of a genetic mutation. Negative suggests that there's no disease. Okay, this is where it gets serious. Let's see. Negative, 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 negative. Negative, negative lahat. Ang dami na to. Ang dami niya. You can see everything here. Negative. Everything's negative. I'm not a carrier. No mutation on my genes. Yes. I'm gonna create healthy babies. Diba? Healthy babies over here. Cancer risk. Okay, let's go. If you have one of the mutation, it means that you have an increased risk. Pag meron dito, it doesn't mean you already have it. But you have the risk. Bali, cancer risk is genetics plus environmental and lifestyle factors. That's your cancer risk. Ah! <laughs> so I'm not carrying any mutation. So that's a good thing. No cancer causing mutation was detected. Thank you so much. Healthy babies. <laughs> so we're going to be producing healthy babies. I will be donating. Oh! 140 genes tested in this panel and there's no cancer causing mutations on my genes. So that's really nice because I nalalaman ko siya. So dementia and brain health. Everything is average risk. So I thought I'll be prone to Alzheimer's. So I guess I'm average risk for that. Yung lola ko may Alzheimer's siya. I am at average risk. I guess that's everybody is in average risk. Na. Uh, let's go to common health risk. Cholesterol nga. Highly elevated risk lang sa cholesterol. A mom ko kasi is risk din sa cholesterol. This is risk. Flu. Yes, sobrang ano sa flu. Nabilis ko. Magka flu. High risk of cholesterol. Pero low cholesterol level sa ko. Ano daw? Ulcer. Risky ako sa ulcer. And the rest is average risk. Drug response na tayo. So drug response, 170 drugs are not really risky. 9 drugs are decreased starting dosage. And 13 drugs were used with caution. Be cautious lang ako sa mga medicine. So maybe addictive siya for me or something like that. I guess that covers everything. So meron naman siya ang report summary. Hindi ko siya nakita agad. Likely to have a normal life. Tendency of getting mosquito bites. Yes, I am prone to dengue. Di talaga ako makamove on dun sa di ako pitli. <laughs> Pero nag-expect on na somewhere na may ano, Pacific Islander trait or something. But I'm Asian. I'm Chinese, actually. Revelation. Happy babies. Yeah, that's it for today's video. This kit was really helpful kasi it really helped me with knowing myself more. Per report is kasama na yung mga mutations and stuff. So, madami yun. Sobrang dami nung list. I just pulled over. That was a lot. It was really eye-opening for me na nalaman ko yung mga bagay na hindi ko alam. <laughs> if you'd like to have yours, you can check out Circle DNA. You can find the link down below. You can check out using my code. I'm not sure if it's still valid kasi sabi nila, 7 days after posting lang siya active. But you can try. And you can check out other people using this. Some of them have their code also. Para mas na discount tayo na 33%. So yeah, it's really nice to have. If you are able to do so, get it. If you can, you can check it out. And it will really help change your lifestyle if ever you have any risk of any mutations in your genes or any traits that you would like to discover. Natuwa ako dahil ginawa ko to. Sobrang natuwa ako dahil nalaman ko yung mga bagay na hindi ko siya kayang madiscover by myself. Natuwa naman ako dun sa mga results and I can access this anytime. I shared more to you than what I even thought I would share initially na akala ko konti lang yung share ko. Pero sobrang dami kong share sa iyo. That's it for today's video. It's Jay and again, thank you so much for watching. Please do subscribe to this channel. Click the notification bell, leave a comment, and give this video a thumbs up. And I'll see you again next time.